I have way too much going on right now to even chance getting sick. They think it's something for old people. Yeah, this is probably the eighth year in a row that I've gotten the flu shot. What happens is the CDC looks to Asia and to see what's happening in terms of flu there. They have their flu season before us so they can look to the year before and see what they have going on and it moves westward, it moves towards us. So we know what happens there will start to happen here. But you don't get the flu from the flu shot. I think that's a misnomer that's out there. You can have some flu-like symptoms for maybe a day or two, but you're not going to get the flu. And if you get the flu after getting your flu shot, it's because you were exposed to it before you got it. It takes two weeks uh, with the flu shot, the inactivated virus, for it to take uh, effect. I already got sick once already, so, you know, I probably don't even need this. I'm probably already immune to it because I already caught it, but, you know, I want to make sure that, you know, I'm okay and everything. Every time I've ever got one, it seems like it's been a lot better every year for me. Ever since I started getting them, it doesn't seem like I get sick as much. Or, so, I don't really have any fears of it at all. Partly as a medical student, uh, you know, I wanted to make sure that both for, for the patients that we see as well as for myself, seeing a lot of patients who are ill, um, wanted to get the flu, the flu shot, uh, and hopefully to avoid getting the flu if I end up getting the flu to make it a little more tolerable. This year, everybody has approved that all vaccine that was made was given thumbs up. So we actually have more vaccine out there um, in the U.S. this year than we've ever had. Your fellow students who are around you are helping protect you. Because um, when you get the flu shot, it's more than just yourself that you're protecting. You're also protecting those who choose not to get it.